Now, fish psychology, unbelievably, is actually a thing. It's way too common that I will experience situations where there's, let's say, one clownfish and then one of them dies for some unforeseeable reason and then the other one just purely mourns until it dies as well. So if anyone knows any fish whisperers, then make sure you let us know because it is unbelievable how bonded the relationship of various fish are to the point where something can happen to one and it's like the other ones just don't get over it. So if you have any stories of fish psychology, then put a little bit of a comment on the bottom of this video.